Yeah, I had a doll growing up and I had a, a G.I. Joe. Oh, yeah. Oh, you a G.I. Joe man. Yeah, yeah, I was I tough. I get my G.I. Joe Joe. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> What's next? I'm going to make the front door. Oh, nice. Arched? Arched top, long double doors. Very typical to Brooklyn. Wow. What do, I, what do you want me to do? You could watch. Just watch? Watch okay. and learn. Starting with a solid piece of wood, I sketch out the design of the front door. Using a bandsaw, I shape the outer edge, cut the inside details, and then cut the door in half so it actually opens. I finish it off with a light sanding. As you can see, I just cut the doors. I made them all out of one piece with an arch top. Now the next step is to hinge them and glue the whole frame in place. You really know what you're doing. Thanks. So As do I. As do you. It's like a married couple, and I love you too. <laughs> What's next? I think uh, I'm going to make the handrails for the stoop, and then we start working on the interior. OK. Shannon might even cry with joy when she sees this. What do you think? She could very well. I cried from joy once, the day I quit the New York City Police Department. <laughs> it was that bad, huh? I was so happy. Using the bandsaw, I cut out the handrails. Then starting with a half-inch dowel, I carve out the banister on the lathe. What's your computer broke? No, that's going to be the wallpaper. Oh, this is the, oh, look at that. And then here, this is the chair railing that's going to go from the floor about four feet up. Oh, so that'll go like that. Yeah. I'm making them in tiles. I'm going to spray glue them and stick them on the wall in sections. And then there's going to be the flooring. Oh, that is cool. Look, if you don't mind, I mean, you got your whole arts and crafts thing going. You got your laptop. You're just I'm jealous. Really not, I mean, I'm really not comfortable doing this kind of arts and crafts stuff. I'm into hardcore building, nailing, screws, hammers. Yeah. I'm a masculine guy. You mind if I step out a little? Go ahead. Go do your thing. All right. I'm going to go get acupuncture. You ever get that done? I haven't. But I need to reduce the stress. OK. All right. I hope, I'm, uh, I hope I come back less stressed. I do, too. Yeah. You got it. All right. Good work, Martha. Thank you. Using an illustration program, I design and print the wallpaper and the floorboards. And using a spray adhesive, I apply them to the interior. So what brings you here today? <sighs> just a little stressed out. It's just a heaviness. That one went right into my cankle. I feel like a science project. What I'm doing here is creating a drop ceiling so that I can carry the battery pack and the wiring for the chandelier. And each floor is going to come out of the middle of this drop ceiling. How to create a chandelier effect. I'm going to run the whole string through here. And I'm going to bunch them all together. What's up? Hey, dude. I'm telling you, you got to try it. What, the acupuncture? Oh, it's fantastic. I feel like 50 pounds have been just lifted off my shoulders. I don't know what Where'd it is. Where'd the 50 pounds go? I don't know, just Off just your back. Away. What Check. are we doing? Look what I've gotten done. Look from here. Give me some. Oh, <laughs> nice. I didn't even, that's a chandelier. Think she's going to like it? I'm like, Shannon's going to love this. Are you kidding? Look at these armrests. I want to sit on here and drink a beer. 